lady of Edo State, Mrs. Bestie Obaseki, has described those making mockery of inability to have her biological children yet with her husband as people who lack understanding, saying such people need to be pitied. Mrs. Obaseki stated this on Saturday during an online interactive session. The first lady was reacting to a question raised by one of the participants who called in from Scotland asking her about her feelings for not for not able to have biological children for the governor. According to the renowned banker, children are gift from God, so one must be patient with God and I really don't mind what women are saying. As I know, I have many children here in a state to take care of as the wife of a governor. Hmm. Really? We've been hearing so much things about uh, this whole thing. And some people say this, some people say that. And, and why would people just even want to bring that into uh, uh, business of the, of the state? What has that got to do? You know that somebody said sometime that in Nigeria, let's talk of Nigeria, leave Africa, because people always say Africa. No, no, no. Talk about your own country. That in Nigeria, everything they will... How, what do they usually say to that too? They will, there's, a, there's a particular word they use. Hmm. Yes, they will stigmatize you with everything. Whether you just have a small wound on your hand, they will stigmatize you. Oh, you look up, they will stigmatize you. Oh, you don't have husband, they will stigmatize you. Oh, you are not married on, you are not getting married on time. Everything, they will, everything, every little thing, they will stigmatize you. You don't have money, the same thing. You have money, wahala. If you are just, whatever, any, in any form, they will just want to stigmatize you. I don't even know why people are just a, a, a why we are like that. Why we are like that. What has that got to do? As he, has that made the governor not to perform? Even the ones that even have children, whether they don't even have, the ones that even, the, the, the ones that have flaunted their children all over the place, have they done better than them? I don't know. Everything is stigmatization. Everything you stigmatize. <laughs> well, the woman has really answered them. Uh, let's hear what people are saying, but she never said whether they have or they don't have. But if they don't have, that is even inconsequential. That is their private life. Hmm. What a wisdom. What a great woman. Your children are many, madam. In the name of Jesus, our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, receive divine endowed children now. Once more, in Jesus' name. You are the winner here, ma. Mark my word, God shall soon visit you in extraordinary dimension. She has used her womb as ritual to proper to prosper her husband. Hmm. God is not wicked. Of what purpose is it for God to block her womb? Everyone will reap whatever they sow. Politicians cannot be trusted. They are not. They are the most wicked and desperate human being. Can you imagine what this particular person is saying? And this person is saying, "Ola de Ligbenga saying this terrible thing." Hmm. You just the vomit rubbish. This shows your level of reason very low mentality gosh i'm sorry for your uh this thing so we shall see how you will end i pray almighty to have mercy on you on your so-called soul you can imagine saying somebody has used a whatever were you there you know people just talk of talk what they don't even know time for god to intervene the matter mrs Sobaseki shall soon deliver triplets good morning madam jehovah god will silence your mockers God will grant your heart desire in the name of Jesus. God will surely grant your heart desire. Because you have been mocked, your womb is open in Jesus' name. Hmm. Can you hear what people are saying here? Uh, you are suffering from wicked from your wicked husband. When did the husband come on board? I don't even understand. When did the husband come on board? So, oh my goodness, it's unfortunate. Go for pregnancy test. You are already pregnant in Jesus' name. Brilliant answer. The Lord of hosts have heard your prayer. Your womb have been opened in Jesus' name. That question was most irrelevant, and she answered it with great wisdom. Only God has answered to our needs. He provides them at his will. At the appointed time, the Bible says, He will make all things beautiful. Madam, please go for IVF. Surrogate mothers. You have money for that. You are, the, are you the one to tell him, to tell her what to do? Busy body people. Are you the one to tell her? Are you more knowledgeable than her? Some people just come and be vomiting what they don't understand. Vomiting what they don't understand. The mockers will surely be ashamed. God has answered your prayers already. 
uh, I join faith with you and your husband to declare that no one who waits on the Lord had ever been disappointed. Your case will therefore not be different. The God who did it for me when I needed children shall also do it for you. Virtuous woman in Jesus' name. Leave it for God. Don't worry yourself. Leave for God. Don't cry no more. Jesus is alive. Amen. You know what you face tomorrow. He understands what you are passing through today. Let us glorify his name. What about if God decides to give you six at once or seven? Remember God. God's way is not our way. So man, leave it for God. Good morning. You know, uh, that makes that reminds me of uh, the governor of uh, Bayesa, the one that just left uh dixon or something that's that's his name yeah i think the the wife had a was it twins or triplets also they said after they've waited for so many uh years and they got it but one thing is that everything nigerians we always some people know Nigeria. they will mock you if you are not getting married on time oh what are you waiting for oh this and this and that in everything they will want to mock you and those people they are not better than you they are not just just better than you they are not doing well, in, in, in their own uh, area of endeavors, they are not. Hmm. They are not God. Those who make a mockery of child, childless couple are ignorant. Children are God's gift. The God that answered by Esa governor, exactly, Dixon, will answer you as well very soon in the name of Jesus, just like I said. Uh, so how does this make news? Yes, because that's what people are saying. It makes news because it's hurting somebody. It's a mockery. Because you are... You care for people's children. God's will, God, God will bless you with your own in Jesus' name. May God hear her. Amen to prayer, to her prayer. God of awesome wonders, the giver of children, will visit you, dear, and give answers to the questions. The evidence will be your own biological children in Jesus' mighty name. God grants your heart desire. Cry of children, we pray and pray for I pray for you in your home and many uh, and, may, and may God strengthen you as you care for your adopted children. Six months after your victory in September, you will get best testimony to share. Don't mind they are they are not God. Don't mind them, they are not just God at all. Of course, you will surely have your children. May the Lord bless your home with your biological children. A lot of people are really coming coming, you know. To, to pray with her. Today, God will answer your prayers. May God grant your our desire. God will answer your prayers by fire in this season. So, guys, uh, what do you think? Let's hear your opinion. You know, in Nigeria, everything they, they bring to limelight, your personal, whatever, they will bring it out. What do you think? Leave your comments below and let us know what you think.